Good evening. This is Suffrages for the 9th of October 9th. We continue our reading of Paolo Coelho's Warrior of the Light, page 68. The warrior of the light is terrified when making important decisions. This is too much for you, says a friend. Go on, be brave, says another, and his doubts grow. After some days of anxiety, he withdraws to the corner of his tent where he usually sits to meditate and pray. He sees himself in the future. He sees the people who will benefit or be harmed by his attitude. He does not want to cause pointless suffering, but nor does he want to abandon the path. The warrior allows the decision to reveal itself. If he has to say yes, he will say it bravely. If he has to say no, he will say it without a trace of cowardice. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy and immortal, have mercy on us. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, God's only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day he rose again. He ascended into heaven. He is seated at the right hand of the Father, and he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Show us your mercy, O God, and grant us your salvation. Give us the joy of your saving help again, and sustain us with your bountiful spirit. Give peace in all the world, for only in you can we live in safety. Keep the nations under your care, and guide us in the way of justice and truth. Let your way be known upon earth, your saving health among all nations. Let not the needy be forgotten, nor the hope of the poor be taken away. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and sustain me with your Holy Spirit. Lord, hear my prayer, and let my cry come before you. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. Lord of the Feast, you have prepared a table before all peoples and poured out your life with abundance. Call us again to your banquet. Strengthen us by what is honorable, just, and pure, and transform us into a people of righteousness and peace. Through Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord. Amen. Keep watch, dear Lord, with those who work or watch or weep this night, and give your angels charge over those who sleep. Tend the sick, give rest to the weary, bless the dying, soothe the suffering, comfort the afflicted, shield the joyous, and all for your love's sake. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Almighty God, bless us, defend us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. And the peace of Christ be with you always.